Hey guys, Sheps Tech here, back with another video, and today is the day we are saying goodbye to our lovely 2017 Volvo XC90. Now, the reason why we're getting rid of it is, like, pretty undisclosed. I, we, we just decided to trade it in because there's some good deal going on. But however, that will go and get me in another video anyways. Uh, but anyways... Today's the day we are picking up our brand new car, and I did, and I did, did say that it, it it it's better, and I did give a couple of hints on Instagram that it, it was better than our car currently, the Volvo XC90, and the color and the interior are the color, outside color is called Thunder Gray, and the inside color is called is a black interior. So it, I, I asked if you guys could match that up. And so far, none of you guys got it right. I posted it on my main account, however, but you guys probably don't know. So, but I did tell everybody not to spoil it. But, but without further ado, let's head, to the, let's, head, let's head to the dealership and, yeah, roll the cinematics. So this is our replacement for the Volvo XC90, and it is a, another Volvo XC90. This is a 2020 Volvo XC90 T6 Momentum, and I have to say this is the one, one of the nicely optioned Volvo XC90 T6 Momentum I've ever seen. And I'm going to go over a quick, a quick overview of it, and then uh, very soon there will be a review on it. That this car is in. So this car, it, it, I don't know if it comes across on camera, but the color of this car is a new car color for 2020. It's called Thunder Gray. And I have to say, it actually is a very nice shade of gray. It's like not, it's not a dark gray, but it's kind of has a little like a blue hint in it. It actually looks like a little bit into wide view. It actually looks really good. Um, and it, this follows through even on the door handle. So no chrome on the door handles, which looks super clean. And also no chrome down here like the last one. So basically, Thunder Gray on this car looks really good. Even down here at these points down here, this was silver on our car, but this one, it just looks so much better body color. Now, the rims that this one comes with is actually the, the better rims. So these are the 21 inch wheels. This is a $1,100 option. However, it just makes the car look so much better. And the big problem with these is they're really easy to curb, but these are 21 inch wheels and they just like, they set the car off so much better than the 20 inch wheels, the standard this comes with, but these are not standard. These This is a $1,100 option, but it looks so much better. Now, the inside of this one is actually not blonde, it's actually charcoal, which is the black interior. However, um, let's get the key out of there so it stops making that singing sound. But it has the charcoal interior, and 
which what well, this is Volvo's third generation leather seats, so they don't wear anymore. So they, it won't have that stupid issue anymore. But it's just way more comfortable in my opinion. The back seats is also the same. There'll be entire review on on this as well. But you guys kind of get the idea here. I'll just push, push this seat back here. But uh, you guys kind of get the idea. There will be an entire review. This There are some upgrades to this car. And there's some, um, how can I say it, downgrades to this car that they took off the options with. But we'll get. I'll give it a start up for you guys real quick. Um, just so you can hear it at least. So, uh, yeah, here we go. Uh, okay, so this here is where the dashboard looks like. So now all... Um, all the cars get a digital driver display, a standard. Let's pop it into, let's pop it into the, uh, comfort mode, and it, here we go. So, much better, as you can see. Let's pop it into the, uh, right, uh, but yeah, this is the car. You, I'll get, I'll, I'll, let's get a good view from the outside with it on. So it has the Thor's hammer LED lights, which looks so good. There's my brother Gabe, see what's up. Um, he has the Thor's hammer LED lights, which looks so good, which uh, I really like this. No bending, sadly. Um, the rear lights, as you can see, they're also LED. They look really, really good. But yeah, this is basically the car. Now, uh, a review will be coming in, as I said, on this car very soon. But let's just quickly switch it off. But that is the car. That is our replacement. A lot of you guys thought we were getting a uh, Tesla to replace this. That will be replacing our A4. But it looks, but I just love this car. The look of this one so much. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, smash the like button. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.